It's been four months since we formed our unity government. They say change is a long process, but a lot happened in four months. We have expanded the circle of, circle of peace. We've taken the Abraham Accords forward. We opened embassies in the UAE and Bahrain and a mission in Morocco. We've met centuries old Jewish communities who kept their unique traditions alive. Every place we went, we made a bit more history. History is made by people who are willing to change it. We chose peace over war, cooperation over conflict, the good of our children over the bad memories of the past. We chose to make our own destiny. The bridge building policy we're leading has brought us new opportunities. Technology brings us even more. The world is becoming accessible to information, to cooperation. We live in an open source world. The most modern technology leading the most ancient values, compassion, integrity, the desire for peace. And you are part of it. In the world of networks, information and people are connected online, a sequence of lights creating the effect we hope to achieve. In, in your mission statement, you write, JFN leverages the power and the creativity of networks to produce change in the Jewish world. So here is our opportunity. Let's tell our story together, a story of openness and optimism, which respects the past, but looks to the future, prefers peace over war, unity over division. I'd like to thank the Jewish Founders, the Founders Network for your support, your commitment, and your friendship. You are a source of pride to Israel and to the Jewish world.